part two, my mother, my biological mother, Shirley Davis, AKA Shirley Savage, she was jealous of me since the day I was birthed. She literally on purpose chose to move me to Louisiana so I can suffer as a child to a teenager all the way up to legal age and miss out on so many amazing soulful people I could have had in Oakland, California, in Sacramento, San Francisco, in all cities in California. She ruined that. She ruined that. My mother knew all the soulful vibrational people in fucking California, especially Oakland in San Francisco, I could have met in my childhood, in teenage years, in legal age years. But no, she had to take me away from that because, oh, my mother was birth in slave owner, Louisiana. So she had to make me go through the same hurtful experiences that she went through. That's wrong, man. My mother did not, bro, my mother did not think straight in her head. She knew people in Louisiana were nothing like people in California. She knew that all the all the memorable fun experiences that my big sister and big brother had in California I was not gonna get that in Louisiana and she still chose to make me grow up in Louisiana all because she was jealous of my spiritual awake she was jealous of my spiritual awakening soulful vibrations and my talents that that will heal planet earth in this multiverse like bro that stuff is sad, man. And that will make a lot of spiritually awake people hate their father and hate their mother for making them grow up in places that their parents had traumas in, man. Like, why? Why, why, why? Why, man? Man, you see the gray hair. Like, you, you see it, man. That's gray hair from stress of growing up in a place that my that my mom grew up in and it was nothing good in louisiana for her which is the reason why she came to california to have a lot of good memories and meet better people but no she had to take me away from oakland california and have me grow up in some fucking weak ass lame ass whitewashed european louisiana like california could really be its own country for real if I'm being honest. Because California has the spirit of a Khalifa. You know, my big brother and big sister and my cousins, they met their they met their partners, aka twin flames or whatever you want to call them. You know, they met all that like they had so many they had so many partners only because they was living in a place of love called california california is the place where a lot of people go to have to have partners and everything they literally people go to california and be living in california so they can have love partners that's why people go there my mother knew i was not going to get that stuff in louisiana so why my mother took me away from a place that had everything for me since the day i was birthed my own mother took me away from a place that had everything for me since the day I was birthed. California had, Cal, like bro, California had my interests, so many opportunities for me to accomplish, but my mother was so jealous of that because I'm her biological son. She wanted me to grow up in a place called Louisiana that had no opportunities for spiritually awake people. I don't know why she did that. All because she had not healed from her traumas in Louisiana. Right? It was fucking St. Joe, Faraday, Louisiana, wherever place. You know? And I'm going to tell you. Every city in Louisiana is terrible. Every city in Louisiana is terrible. Louisiana is the worst place on planet Earth. It's no place for no people that are talented, spiritually awake. That place can just burn. You know? My mother went through fucking, my mother went through slavery in Louisiana. My mother, Shirley Davis, AKA Sir Shirley Savage, she went through slavery in Louisiana from those Europeans and they forced her to be a damn Christian and shit. So 
when my mother had me when she was like the age of 27 or 28, she just, she, she decided, well, let me have my firstborn child and the rest of my children like waste their years in Louisiana. That's what she said in her head, just because she went through the traumas in Louisiana. Cause a lot of parents, a lot of parents, they always tend to like move their children back to a place where, where they had traumas at just so their first their firstborn and secondborn and thirdborn, fourthborn, fifthborn child go through the same thing that they that they did. It don't make no sense. Why would my own mother want me to go through the same hurtful, sad experiences that she went through in Louisiana? Like it don't make no damn sense. Like my mother took me away from Oakland, California. Man, bro. And look there's a fair share of jealous people everywhere, but look, I wasn't going to deal with so much hateful people in California as much as I had dealt with it in Louisiana. That's for sure. You know, people in California are more loving. You know, they're more accepting towards spiritually awake people because Louisiana, especially people with my, with my melanated skin color, they're not, accept, they're not acceptable to spiritually awake people, especially these melanated skin dark-skinned males who are spiritually awake like myself they're not accepting of me mm -hmm. that's why i never enjoy i never enjoyed going out in louisiana it was nothing in louisiana it's nothing in new orleans it's nothing in no city in louisiana for spiritually awake talented soulful beings it's not there's more stuff to, there's more there's more opportunities for soulful vibrational people in Amarville, California than it is in fucking New Orleans and Shreveport, Louisiana. These are all facts. No one can tell me no different. And all these fucking Louisiana homers, man, stop the shit. Don't 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 defend it just because you was birthed there. You know what I'm saying? Like, to be honest, I hate my mother for having me grow up in Louisiana. I hate my mother for this shit because it ruined my childhood. It ruined my teenage years. I could have had the same. I could have had, I could have been loved by so many people if I had grew up in Oakland, California. Bro, nobody that grew up in Oakland, California had been hated by so many people. It never happened, especially spiritually awake people. You know, bro, I could have had so much. Bro, I could have had so, I could have had so many uh, females that would have loved me for me if only I if only my mother had not took me away from some if only my mother had not took me away from Oakland California I don't know why she did that and I have every right to hate her for that she knew what she was doing she knew I did not like Louisiana but she still tried to force me to like it force me to like it try to get me get me into things in Louisiana that I was not interested in because the people there are not a fit for my vibrations. People in Louisiana are soulless vibrational beings. My mother knows this, but she still refused and refused for so many years, all the way up to this day, to make sure I don't connect with soulful vibrational people in California. Bro, my, my mother, my mother would be so supportive of my female cousins in California, but when it came to me, it was always jealousy. And I'm a dark skinned male that's spiritually awake. She didn't want me to meet soulful, vibrational, spiritual awake, talented people in California because California, especially San Francisco and Oakland, those in Sacramento, it's, it's full of spiritually awake, talented, soulful beings. These are all facts. And my mother knew what, what my mother saw that and was like, nah, I'm not gonna have, I'm not gonna have my firstborn child grow up in Oakland, California. And she can make up all the lame excuse. My mother can make up all the lame excuse about how uh, violent California is. That shit is false. Because I, my, my big sister and big brother have been there for like 30 plus years. If it was that damn violent, they would have they left ASAP. So she just used so many uh, scapegoat uh, like excuse mechanisms to make me suffer in Louisiana. Because she didn't want the best for me. She only wanted me to be a tool to the slave owner society to, as an extension of herself. My mother don't see me as her child, man. How can I like my mother for, for making me suffer?